You also have some methods and frameworks that you provide in your book around how this decision making is actually done by, by leaders, whether it's decision making quickly or if it's leading with impact. Can you just provide an example of one of those frameworks and methods? Absolutely. We went behind the scenes to really decode the machinery that the best CEOs use. And so I'll offer, we offer a few frameworks, as you said, but I'll just give one example, um, which sounds very simple. So CEOs move fast by simplifying complexity. So, and, and, and what's beautiful about that is actually no matter whether they run a $2 million company or a $20 billion company, inevitably what a CEO does is they try to walk into the business and really understand what matters the most. What will make, what will move the needle? What will be most important for the ability to deliver for the customers and the bottom line of the business? Reed Foss, for anyone out there who wears glasses, so you've never heard of a Reed Foss, but actually you've benefited from him. So Reed ran a couple of uh, companies. He ran Vision Works and National Vision, uh, which uh, is a, uh, set, it's a retailer uh, selling glass, glasses. And uh, Reed came into the business. He was valued at about $50 million, I believe. And what he was able to do, the business was really struggling. So what he did is he came in and he asked his team, so last time we did well, what did we do? And he worked with the team to identify 12 factors that made the biggest difference on performance. And for the rest of his tenure, he drove on those 12 factors relentlessly, whether it's 12 or three. And then he was able to have a very successful exit. He built a $5 billion company that got sold to KKR and uh, had, a, had a great and a happy ending. But the biggest thing he, in looking uh, backwards that he would share is that he was able to simplify complexity and help focus the team on things that mattered the most. And that's something we can all do in our own life, whether you find yourself in the CEO role or if you're just thinking about your daily life, like literally starting your morning with asking yourself, what will make the biggest difference and how do I attend to those things first um, can really help you advance.